I'm going to read three poems. One is an old poem, one is a changed poem, and one is a new poem. This first poem is entitled, Always Assist. You silently pour out your heart to him. He wipes away your tears. You feel lonely and neglected, alone and unprotected, yet with him you no, you no longer fear. He's the only one who listens to you, understanding when you go amiss. When his daughter's led astray, you will again show her the way, and as your husband, I will always assist. Yes, you told me it's true, at our wedding I do. Your God and I, you love us both. Yet in a world of divorce, even I grow up in force to remind you of your spiritual oath. I do provide you with wealth, education, and health, yet humbly recognize the gist. Your father in reality is part of our spirituality, and as your husband, I will always assist. I will share in your belief as well as your grief, and you have my surety. When you two collaborate, I will also corroborate. I recall why you married me. Honor and love him, not even I am above him. Talk to him, yes, I insist. And when you read your book, let you please take a look. Never leave me out in the mist. You will always remain, and I also the same, proof that both of us do exist. Girl, if you two if the two of us sustain, the three of us will forever gain. And as your husband, I will always assist. As he changes it, it's called abandon. As he slams the door behind him, you stand unamused, confused, and bereaved. Till death to us part, he told you in your heart. He made you, he made you believe he'd never leave. All your dreams fade as he is driving away. Why would a man leave, tell love goodbye? If you read your Bible, you know you'd never be idle. He would never abandon you, neither would I. Your father, true, announced disapproval of you, pronouncing you also was your mother. Now you're totally confused. Joining them are your nephew, niece, cousin, uncle, aunt, and brother. As well as your sister, you truly do miss her. Would you have left love and not tell love why? His pictures on your phone, is your picture on his phone? He will never abandon you, neither will I. Look, Miss Hectic, neglected, rejected, and disrespected. You are the reason why I write this poem. Never give the devil its due. Lock your door behind you. Heed my rhyme for this time you came home. Without you, he's stranded. Without you, he's abandoned. So tell him in his heart goodbye. Miss Confused and Bereaved, in my love you will believe. Never abandon him, neither will I. This poem. It is, so far as entitled, What Rhymes With Money. Your accountant's wrong, your money's gone. Did you survive the Great Depression? You sold your gold, your homes foreclosed. Are you surviving the Great Recession? No IRA, no 401k. Diamonds are no longer a girl's best friend. Your Roth won't last, the stock market crashed. Yet we must endure to the end. Without cloud, no doubt, you can forget that bailout. Your offshore accountant won't be pleased. Here's a hint. Start reading the fine print. Wrap it on your capital or pay fees. If you enjoy my rhyme, drop me a dime and live a happy and balanced life. Be responsible with your dough or you'll open my to your and we'll put money before your life. So pay only the unhealthy and pray for the wealthy. They are the root of all evil. Well, maybe. Listen. While the 1% don't agree, let's spend wisely our currency. Have fun with your funds. It's all great. <laughs>